Let's start this meditation by finding a comfortable seated position, either on a chair or on a cushion, cross-legged, spine straight, crown of the head lifting, as though someone were pulling a string from the top of your head. Breathe in deeply and exhale deeply. Notice the feeling of the breath moving through your nostrils and out through your nostrils. Do this a couple more times, inhaling deeply through the nose and exhaling deeply through the nose. Now return your breath to its normal pace. And bring your attention to the sensations that are inside your body. The strongest sensation, whether that's physical or emotional. Now let's bring our attention to an emotional pain. Perhaps you're experiencing an emotional pain around a physical pain. Or you're experiencing an emotional pain that is created by your circumstances something in your life has triggered this pain and you're not sure what to do with it, bring your attention to it. Where in your body do you feel it? Do you feel it in your chest? Is it in your stomach, in your head? Could be in multiple places. Where do you feel it most prominently? Your emotional pain could be anxiety could be depression, could be anger, could be frustration, could be self-doubt, not feeling good enough. There may be a reason and you might know the reason. Or there may not be a reason at all. Whatever the case may be, see if you can relax into the feeling. Allow it to be there without expecting it to go anywhere or to do anything.
notice if there are any thoughts around it. Any sort of resistance to it at all. Whether you want it to go away. Whether you're tired of it. And if the emotion has anything that it wants to say, anything at all, hear it out. Be the listener. If your emotion wants to say, you're not good enough. Acknowledge what it has to say. Listen. You'll never be good enough. Okay. Just listen. What else does the emotion have to say? Maybe it doesn't have anything to say. Maybe it's hiding. And that's okay. Sometimes it takes a few goes for this part of you to feel safe enough to express itself. So just be patient. Just sit. There is nowhere to be. There is nothing to do. Other than hold space. Patiently and alertly waiting like a cat. When a cat sees a mouse, a cat must be extremely still in case it scares the mouse away. But it must also be alert. Tune back into your body and observe how the feelings in your body may or may not have changed since sitting here with them. They may have evolved into other feelings or they may not have evolved at all. See if they have anything else to say.
See if you can describe the feeling as though it were an object. Is it heavy? Is it light? What color is it? Is it black? Is it yellow? Is it an object? Or is it gas? Or liquid? Maybe it's a form of thick, viscous liquid holding you down. Limp. Perhaps it's draining your life force. See if you can ask it why it would be doing that. And don't look for the answer. Just wait for it, like a cat waiting for a mouse to make its move. Is it there to protect you? in some way? Is it on your side? And if so, what is it protecting you from? Maybe there are no answers that come to you and that's fine.
Notice if there's any tension in your body. Notice if your jaw has started to clench. If your back has started to round. Straighten your spine and lift your head as though someone were pulling it from a string. Soften the muscles around your face. Perhaps there is a feeling that whatever it is you're experiencing will never change, will never go away. See if you can be with that. If the feeling really does never go away, See if you can be okay with that. Taking a deep breath. And exhale fully. Bring your attention back to the room. What can you hear in your surroundings? Maybe you can hear the traffic outside. Maybe you can hear birds chirping. Footsteps. Now start to move your fingers and your toes. Slowly open your eyes.